Now, Mr. President, on another issue, Americans know that cyber attacks are attacks on their privacy and their property. No one wants to think about a stranger rifling through their medical records. No one wants to think about a criminal stealing their credit card information. That's why we have this bipartisan cybersecurity bill before us here in the Senate. This bipartisan legislation will help protect America's most private and personal information by sharing information between the private and public sector on cyber threats. Experts say the tools in this bill can help prevent future attacks in both the public and the private sectors. It contains important measures to protect civil liberties and individual privacy. And it's been carefully vetted and scrutinized by senators of both parties. No wonder this bill passed through committee with nearly unanimous bipartisan support, 14 to 1. The House already voted to protect the privacy of Americans by <coughs> passing cyber legislation. With a little cooperation, the Senate can as well. That's why I urge all members to vote today to move forward on this bipartisan bill, which will set up votes on amendments from both parties. With continuing cooperation, we can take an important step toward protecting the privacy of our constituents.